Good evening, folks. February 22nd, Thursday evening. I just went out and got propane. And we have some lingering snow. And this forecast is for, and it's definitely snowing on the divide. But the desert's clear. Forecast is for snow all week, like this, probably five inches and six inches at a time. So I've been trying to work on sealing this up. So I kind of rigged it till summer. Here's going to be a bottle wall, so I just shut that up. And I closed the fall, far wall in uh, with a piece of plastic yesterday. Because I was trying to uh, finish the Solex, but it was too cold. So I couldn't maneuver the Solex. But you can see I moved a little snow back here this morning. And the roof is now shedding. But let's go inside and see. Uh, the sun just came out, so I'll see how warm it got in here. <laughs> so everything is really sealed really tight. And it's not even finished, but it is super insulated in here. I have peas coming up already, and I'm trying to wire this final fan. And I just fried one so this is the last fan i have so hopefully i won't fry this one or i have to make an ebay purchase but i do have a thermometer in here somewhere it's digital and i've moved it well that won't really be good for the video it feels about 80 degrees in here maybe a little warmer The geothermal heat pump is working. As soon as the sun came out, it's harvesting that heat up in this pipe and it's bringing it down into the ground to store for tonight. Now, I was in here earlier this morning and the lowest temperature it got last night was above freezing. So that's good news. Oh, here's the thermometer. Let's go take a look. So it's 59 in the dirt, according to the thermometer. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's been up to 93 in here today. 39% humidity. Then we got peas uh, pushing up in here. I just got those in the ground and... I'm going to be working on planting some more beds. So the geothermal greenhouse is uh, working. It's closed, although makeshift. And it's warm in here. And that's a boom. Thanks for watching.